Hello friends, I'm just going to share a very simple model, an effective model, which I've understood from my own experience, marketing experience of over 20 years, uh, by researching uh, all the world's best brands. And I've even used these research methodology with my own clients and even I've applied this to my own self also. So this is just going to take five to seven minutes of your time. So it's just only one slide and it's all about mindset. So We can't hear anything. We can't hear anything. Hello? Hello? We can't hear anything here. Uh, am I audible now? Yes, and now you are audible. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. Could you please come back from the starting? Yeah, sure. Sure. Definitely. Definitely. Okay. okay I'm sorry. I think we have missed out due to unstable uh, internet connection. Hope I am audible again, Sriram, now, right? Yes, sir. You are audible, sir. Yeah. Thank what you. I was sharing is. As human beings, we, we go through certain stages in our life. We used to be a baby, then we move to a teenager, then we become matured and suddenly at one point of time, we become uh, more enlightened and try to understand, uh, try to understand the deeper meanings of life, right? So I've applied that same concept um, here in marketing also. Uh, this is based on my own experience as a marketer, uh, the, uh, my interaction with entrepreneurs, my research with um, some of the best brands in the world and how they approach marketing at each and every stage. So I'm not going to take much of uh, your time uh, since I've been allotted only five to seven minutes. So I just have only one slide here. So stage number one, we all go through these stages it's called teenage marketing. In teenage, we used to focus on the sexy side of life, right? So we want to, uh, uh, on the visible elements of life. So similarly, even in marketing, uh, I found uh, something called teenage marketing where we focus, focus more on clicks, likes, views, and more of bus creation and hype creation. We focus more on tools which come out every day uh, and we are more fascinated in all those things. Suddenly, what happens is you started maturing in your marketing. So, you know, one, one fine day you ask a question saying that, okay, uh, what about uh, I, I focused on clicks, likes, views, and all those things? What about revenue? Am I building a brand? Am I getting a revenue out of all those exercises? So, suddenly you start realizing this thing and you start moving from stage one to, to stage two in your life stage as a marketer. So now you're mature. Now you measure things based on your revenue, profits, and suddenly you, you also start feeling, I need to build a brand, long-term brand for my company or for your personal brand. So even while focusing, while being matured, at one point of time, you have, you have, you have started driving everything, even your business as a founder or as an entrepreneur, you start getting that enlightenment buddha buddha says that enlightenment is the end of suffering right i've even shared these three life stages of marketing in my recent linkedin post two three days back i've just converted that as a framework and sharing it with you so you become enlightened so what what i mean by enlightened is you start thinking from a mission or a cost perspective you not just uh, revenue, not just about brand, not just about clicks, likes. What am I, for what purpose I am here? So what, for what purpose I am running my business? So you start sharing that as a story to your market. Then you start aligning your mission with your product. 
then you you are not bothered about the whole world you are bothered about your small group of community which through which you can make an impact so enlightened marketing is how people like mahatma gandhi uh, people like martin luther king people like nelson mandela people like um, steve jobs uh, people like elon musk drives the entire marketing of their company they are not bothered about clicks likes views or how many people know me or they they don't even bother about revenue and brand but what happens is the secret of uh, this is when we become enlightened in marketing the stage 1 and stage 2 takes care of itself you get lot of clicks likes views buzz and hype around your brand your revenue and brand is taken care as a by product you when you start driving towards uh, everything towards our vision and do something for our community then we don't bother about stage 1 and 2 so that is what i thought of sharing with you uh, with all of the entrepreneurs founders um, and all of us it's not just about business even if you want to try um, build a career or build a profession i think this will this this framework will help thank you so much for your time and patience see you all